It is time now for the final round. Five minutes left. Hold on, hold on. Let me finish my lead game real quick, and then I'll be ready. Okay. Be kidding me. No, I'm sorry. I'm ready. All right. Yeah, 100% of my Five attention. Five minutes. Flat Earth. Is the Earth flat? No, 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 Raj. He doesn't want to do this. Right. He doesn't want to do this. This is the... I'll do that. Yeah, we can do Flat Earth. Flat Earth, Earth topic. Final round. Five minutes. Starting okay. with... John, go ahead. Five minutes. Good luck. Sure. Destiny, uh, why do you believe in the heliocentric model? Because we've got navigation charts that have relied on it for hundreds of years. The sailors have relied on the Earth being uh, round. We've got air airplane pilots that rely on the Earth being round. We've got mathematical formulas and all of physics is relying on Earth being round. In order to believe that the Earth is flat, you literally have to believe in a conspiracy that millions or hundreds of millions of people have been forced to buy into for literally generations. And none of these people have ever leaked or told anybody that the shit is all fake at any point in history. And it is absolutely fucking absurd that you think that that could be true. So uh, you don't think it's gotten leaked and it didn't, I mean, it got, it became popular in 2014, but you said airplanes, air plane that flies over a motionless plane. Like Einstein said, the earth is an observable motionless plane. Do you know an air, do you know what a gyroscope is? I know what a gyroscope is, but the earth is not motionless. The earth rotates on an axis. Oh, okay. Okay. There's six scientific experiments that all failed. I know what you're talking about, but do you know, you know what a gyroscope is, right? Yeah. I'm aware of what a gyroscope is. On an airplane. What, what about a gyroscope on an airplane? What does it do? I, I don't know. I've never tried it before. It measures the plane level to the earth because it'll fight gravity, right? That's what the, <clears throat> that's what the instrument does. Okay. So I'm, I'm wondering why you said airplanes when they fly 30,000 feet in, in altitude and NASA says you can see curvature at 60,000 feet. Weather balloons double the height and don't measure anything. The only time you've seen a curved earth is through government propaganda, NASA or Hollywood? I mean, so we can believe that every single shot from space is doctored and every single astronaut that's been involved with that are all involved in the doctoring process and none of them have released anything. The reason why I bring up airplanes is because if you look at the paths that airplanes fly from one place to another, it's never a straight line because the maps that we see are flat, but the Earth itself is curved. Right, right. You said you'd have to believe that NASA doctors their photos and fake the moon landing. Wouldn't it be interesting if instead of spending all the money to go to the moon, they fake it and make a hundred billion dollars in tax revenue every year from it. Wouldn't it be personally? Like NASA has been criminally underfunded for the past fifty years. Okay. So if their goal was okay. to make a, if their goal okay. was to make a fuck okay. ton of money, they failed okay. miserably. Okay. That's firstly. Okay. Okay. Secondly, okay. it is okay. actually it would be cheaper to fly to the fucking moon than it would be to try to fake the moon landing. We don't have the technology to fake the moon landing. You're, it's not even, how would you even do that? How yeah. would you fake the moon yeah. landing in a studio using the technology of the sixties? Yeah. How? Hey. Yeah, and you, you're saying with the 1960s technology, they went to the moon before an iPhone, you fucking... Yeah, because idiot. in the 1960s, we oh, could fucking... Shit, that was in the 1960s, we didn't have the, all the digital you, shit we have around you, film today. We did saying, have missiles. Listen, saying, we shot you, fucking rockets on, all on, the time. So you're, you're saying they couldn't, they couldn't Hollywood fake it, but they have the technology to go to the moon? Number two. That's right. Number well, hold two. Hold on, hold on. Are you telling me that it's no, less no, likely? Are you told no, 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 no. Wait, you think that it's less I love likely you, bro. on, on you a planet clip. where we're already firing off missiles all over the place that we can't engineer a rocket that yeah. can take somebody to the moon, but when yeah. we have none of the digital technology required to fake hours yeah. and hours yeah. of footage going to I'm the moon, you, then yeah, we yeah, wouldn't yeah. be able to do that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You, said, you said missiles. Have you ever seen the trajectory of all missiles, all rockets that go into leave low Earth orbit? Have you ever seen that they arc? That's interesting. Person? How is that uh, interesting? No, 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 no. I, I'm going to ask you the final question okay, just to it. test your IQ. The most corrupt president we can agree with the Watergate scandal is Richard uh, Nixon, right? You, mm -hmm. So now, it, it, in my world, he faked the moon landing. Uh, there's a clip on YouTube where he talks to astronauts on a telephone. That would be a landline-based telephone. To, to talking to people 200,000 miles away in 1969. Do you believe he spoke to Neil Armstrong on the telephone from the White House? Yes or no? Yes. You are the smartest guy on Twitch. John, here's a question right now. Ready? I'm done, are, you, wait, wait, wait. are you ready for this? Are you ready for this? Are you ready for this? Yeah. John, I know you're listening to me. Walk into your house right now, pick up a landline phone, and see if you can call your cell phone. Fucking checkmate, dude. Yo, yo, hold on. No, 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 no. How does it work? How does it work? It's not connected, is it? Yeah, no, no, no. It's not I'll, connected, I'll is tell it? you. I'll tell yeah, you. Tell me. I want to hear it. I want to hear it. Right. 97%. 97% of all Earth Wi-Fi is done through triangu triangulation cellular towers. We can both agree. Why do you lose connection in the mountains if there's satellites and stuff, right? It's because, because there's not satellites. No, 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 no. Hang on, hang on. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, Destiny. You lose connection when you're outside of the grid because 
It's done through cellular towers and weather balloons. It's all on Google too. It, it's is, all, it is all on Google. Oh, and I'm know. sure they've and got I, special relay satellites that they have set up to ensure the communication so, exists. Right, okay, okay, okay. Yeah. You, you believe in the Mars rover. That means you believe in magical space Wi-Fi that sends photos 200 million miles away, correct? It's not magical space Wi-Fi. It's physics. There close. are frequencies you're, that we can broadcast from really getting, far away. Yeah, how do you yeah, think? Wait, okay, how do you think you're we see stars cooked. and other solar you're, systems? You're, you're, getting, you're getting cooked. Can you please show on the Discord a picture of a star that's not computer generated? A picture of a star that's not computer. I mean, I would have to crawl into the fucking Hubble telescope to, to show you no, that. No, no, How can no, I you, possibly do that? No, you, you, you said they took pictures. They would be on NASA's .gov website, right? You can go outside when it's night and you can look up at a star. No, no, no. I'm, I'm asking you the picture of the sun. Is that an authentic photo to you? What, what do you mean by authentic, John? Come on, don't don't do the wordplay, please. I'm. Sorry. Well, I don't. I mean, you tell. Is it? A, it's. They're all digital images. The way that they're trans. It's not like they give you a fucking Polaroid. Right, so so if I bring up a Google picture of the sun or from NASA, you would tell me that's a real photo, not a composite. I mean, some of them are probably composites. Some of them are probably real photos. We could probably look right now. So we could look for real photo of sun or unmodified photo this... of sun. And I'm sure you could find pictures of it if that's what you really want. I, f I feel so bad because I saw you do a debate with a flat earther on your podcast and it's on YouTube. And I didn't even want to go into that one. But Destiny, do you feel like you're winning this one? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I am. If anybody knows anything about physics, here's a question. Why is it, if, if flat earth is, is real, why is it that the one nation that was competing with us the most, more than any other nation during the space race, why wouldn't Russia come out and say, hold on, all of this is bullshit. The earth yeah. is actually flat. Yeah, so since the dawn of time, pharaohs have chilled with pharaohs and uh, made fake wars just to keep the uh, working class always kind of fighting each other. If you look at it, the Antarctic Treaty is signed by 57, 52 different countries. So there, nobody can go in Antarctica unless it's a government kind of like thing. But it's militarized for a reason. It's the only treaty not broken for a reason. If this treaty has been held up this long it proves that the earth they work together the cold war is a fugazi the Russia, so why is US... it that when the soviet union was on the verge of collapse when they were competing yeah. all over the world you're saying we work yeah. together while we've yeah. got things like we've got germany divided by yeah. the fucking berlin wall we've got all these proxy yeah. conflicts yeah. around yeah. the world the yeah. us yeah. is like oh we're gonna collapse but we're not gonna take america down with us yeah. we're not gonna what, reveal what, anything about what, 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 what i'm saying is the federal reserve which they print money is not regulated it's higher than government so there are people who own a lot more than countries first there of all that's not so, even true the no, federal no, no. reserve the federal reserve the the, the chairman is appointed by the president love, what do you mean I, 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 okay maybe i have a book i'm gonna send to you all right um okay. but destiny like uh so i you know history you know that 90 percent of russian technology was given by the u.s you there's no way you believe in this cold war you do that they're competing really okay so the cuban missile crisis all of that shit everything is all fake I mean, a, a lot of the stuff the government does is fake. Yeah, I mean, you agreed that Vietnam was uh, a fake. This is the, you know what? Flag. I think this is the first time I've ever won two debates back to back because not only is this fucking fly their shit crazy, but now oh. you're reinforcing my belief that religious people are fucking crazy too, which Wait, helps our earlier debate. So I you, appreciate are you, that, John. Are, are you distracting the audience by calling me names? How am I distracting anybody? You're being, you, you, you're, you're telling me, me that there is a conspiracy theory that dawn, that, that spans the history of mankind Mm -hmm. That every government agency no, is bought no, into. No, that can I, can, if yeah. I can in, if I can interject, you said spans the dawn time for most of human history and every culture and religion. They talked about a flat Earth with the stars inside a closed system. But up until the 1900s, you can see it's leaked all over dark web and Google that up until the 1900s, Russians were taught about flat Earth. This is a new concept. I know what you're trying to say. Even but, Christopher, uh, even in the time of Christopher Columbus sailing the Earth, even yeah. then they knew that the Earth was spherical. Yeah, and, and he circumnavigated. East to west, just like how the sun moves. What did he use? The North Star Polaris has not deviated even inches off the sky for thousands of years. If you're flying through space, how come stars never intersect? Why do star trails always make perfect counterclockwise circles? It's because because the Earth is spinning on an axis, and those stars are so tremendously right, far away. Right. Because we're not going to see yeah, move to the sky. Yeah, but you're not just spinning through an axis. You're, the sun is moving too, so it's an eccentric model where you're flying through space. So. Wait, yes. John Zerka, if you no, look no, no. up at the sun, if you look up at the sun and you walk around your apartment building, the sun's not going to move through the sky, dog. No, it's it's no, insanely fucking far away. I didn't say, I don't really say it'll move through the sky. I'm saying for thousands of years, the North Polaris has not moved, right? 
So yeah, you, because this is a star that's probably like hundreds of millions or light years away yeah, from us. Okay, Why would we expect and, and, it to move? And now we get to the mathematician part. Okay, perfect. <laughs> so no, no, no. So you, you believe that the truth is subjective where, oh, if it's thousands of light years away, uh, time is perceived differently. We who believe in God believe there's one objective truth. That's God, right? Uh, I have a question. If it takes, let's say, I mean, like, you, you don't want to talk about the Antarctic Treaty, right? I, I don't think it's relevant to any of this. Really? Yeah. I don't think that because some countries have treaties around obscure okay, parts the, of the world that they don't travel too much anyway, that that proves flat earth. No. Okay. I'm not going to talk about flight trails. You, you don't, you discredit all the engineers and the airplane pilots that found the flat earth through the dark web in 2005. I'm going to go with all the right. 99.99% 99 of engineers and pilots that believe that the earth is Closing sphere. statements, gentlemen. Cool. It's the right. end. So, um, Closing statements. Destiny, you have, where does, you have where, very short yeah. amount of time, John. Go, please. Destiny, close where the, the word planet comes from the word plane. They added a T to confuse Destiny's dumbass because it's a motionless plane, right? What I'm trying to say is uh, if you look at how the horizon works, the higher you go, um, like all of the mathematics check out in my version, not yours. We have the scientific method with curvature, with constellations, with everything. I don't know why you say we're crazy. You, you believe in water sticking to a ball when water always seeks its level. I mean, like, it's never been proven. The only time you measure gravity is outside of your realm of existence because you say you have to leave low Earth orbit. You have to go to space. It has to be as big as Earth. You'll never find... If it's scientific method, you should be able to test it repeatable in nature, correct? So gravity is your God. It's your theory. It's a faith-based thing. There's a lot of things that are faith-based, but you're getting dominated. Go ahead. Uh, I mean, I think we can summarize this whole debate with you saying that planet is plain with a T added at the end. Planet comes from an, or, an old Greek word, and it means wanderer, like wanders around the solar yeah, system, yeah, yeah, like I'm isn't a, like heliocentric I'm at the center of the fucking universe. I mean, we can talk about any of these water finds its level. I mean, like these are all like the same conspiracy theories does, that have been no, brought no, no, up no, and no. debunked no, a no, billion no. times in the past. I mean, Destiny, does water always seek its level? Has it ever stuck to any triangle or ball ever in history? I mean, if that triangle or ball is generating enough gravity to keep the water on it, then yeah, right, it right. And the, and the only way you can measure gravity is on a planetary scale. So technically, you can't repeat that science. It's not real science. You can't do it in nature. You can't do it in a lab. Another thing, rainbows. If you look at how do you re recreate with a scientific method a rainbow in a garage? Wait, what do you mean you know, we can't measure gravity? We've 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 measure gravity all the time. I, I I just we just agreed that it's on a planetary level. It has to oh? be on a so the, the scale cannot be repeated in nature. You what do you mean? It? Like we can't make a planet? I mean, like you can look at if yes, you want. We can look up videos. Uh, wait, wait, we can look up videos right now of astronauts in space that like pull water around a ball and watch it like congeal there and float. I mean, we can do. We can look I, at the I, YouTube you know videos what? right you now. Know what, you Destiny? want? No, yeah. we'll go. We'll do it. We'll do it on your channel, and we'll send each other two, three videos for like twenty minutes yeah. for debate. I, I have twenty minutes of my day for you. So what I'm trying to say, Destiny, is uh, how do you recreate a rainbow in a garage? Rainbows are dome shaped because it is a dome. Nothing's left low Earth orbit. You recreate a rainbow in a garage with water vapor a light source and a glass dome that's why sun dogs rainbows are dome shaped they're not spherical in any, any sense but you can I, create a rainbow hold on anybody that's ever been outside knows that you can create a rainbow without a glass dome no. anytime you want if you turn a sprinkler on you can see a rainbow appear you don't need a glass dome for that exactly and what what is the where how is the rainbow appearing in nature the rainbow appears in nature because when light passes through water, the water no, no. causes the different wavelengths to refract. But what do you mean? The dome shape is being caused by the dome. That's why rainbows, small or large, are all reflecting off. If I ask you to recreate a rainbow in a garage... First of all, it doesn't make a dome shape. It makes a spherical shape. It's A, it, a rainbow is a sphere. It doesn't we, make a, it's a... Did you say a rainbow is a sphere? Yeah. They're, they're, well, it's a circle technically because it's a two-dimensional plane, but... Do you disagree? Yeah. Do you, I want, do you want to lock that in, that a rainbow is spherical? Have you ever seen a full rainbow before? Yeah, uh, it is. Just say just say for the... Yeah, a, a, a rainbow is like a, a spherical, spherical thing, yeah. Yeah, yes. Okay. All right, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, you've heard okay. the gentleman speak. It's now time to vote. Hold Please, on, Raj, wait a second. What if the examples given in this very argument of russia versus us and the conspiracy of the earth being flat being kept hidden for the us what if all these propagandas all these false wars what if right now we are seeing that same brainwashing happening on a smaller relative level 
where Zorka is Russia trying to speak the truth and Destiny is the US keeping the truth from being spoken. And this is a smaller model okay. of the bigger model that we live in. Holy shit! Unfold Holy shit! Speak. Holy shit! I, what Holy kind fuck! Of, what kind of squad W cocaine is that, Raj? Whoa! Dude, Whoa. did you see this? <laughs> Whoa, this whoa. is why I advocate for education reform in the United States because holy <laughs> fucking shit. Oh my god. <laughs> Ladies whoa, and did gentlemen, you, that, Raj? <laughs> you have heard holy from both whoa. sides. Whoa. It's now time to vote who you uh, want to hang win. On, hang, the on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Destiny, Destiny. Yeah. Just, to, to, just to show you, uh, we have the scientific map and everything, but uh, what is the United Nations flag if not our flat earth map? Oh, you got it, dude. They snuck it in there. I mean, if they fooled you, where's the edge of space? <laughs> what? <laughs> the universe is literally defined as everything in existence. So there can't be an edge to everything. Exa exa exactly. So until until we can actually go to Antarctica, I know it's a treaty, it's a militarized zone, but we're either dealing with a infinite plane. Have you ever been on like an international flight before? Uh. <laughs> so weird that you guys disagree with me because admiral bird the first person to explore antarctica in front of a flat earth map was interviewed these questions the clips on youtube uh i just find it so weird how you guys go against admiral bird you know i mean i find it so weird how you would go against literally you know 15 different you, scientific you disciplines. mean you mean government propaganda Pro all, all education now is government no, no, propaganda no, 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 wait no, here's no, a question no. John, John, John. i got a real question i had a real question for you real question yeah. If the government gone. propaganda is so strong that we have multiple countries, we've got multiple academic fields, we've got multiple institutions of education, all these people are all bought in for 200, 300 years or whatever, all bought yeah. into this flat earth shit, however, however many years it's been, right? Why wouldn't Not they just all. delete? Why wouldn't they just delete the flat earth shit off the internet? Well, that, that's the thing. When you search up flat earth, you don't get the stuff that I research. You yeah, get, you do. No, no, no. You get you get a disc flying through space. You get you get flat earth society bullshit. You don't get the scientific method. The shit that I'm into is you'll never find it. Nobody will ever find well, it. Then how the fuck did you find it? Well, that's the thing. Before it got deleted, I was looking into. Uh, it was a Joe Rogan podcast. I said Eddie Bravo is such an idiot. I looked into it and I realized, my God, they have the scientific method. They have engineers in the Discord. They have airplane pilots. There's no way Destiny could beat three hundred thousand airplane pilots in one group. Do you see you know? what my country has become, Manuel? This is what this is what we live with in the United States. These are the people that vote for Trump, by the way. This is what my fucking country is like. Right? Uh, uh, what you, well, uh, I'm in fucking Canada. Jealous. I'm in Canada, bro. Your country, Manuel. In, in Manuel's my, okay, my, my, my continent. Sometimes we uh, we drift a little bit north and 